hello guys today i'm going to tell you what is the difference between serialization and customized serialization customization is just like uh, to convert a java uh, object to a file supported object file supported form like suppose you have a file uh, you have a object and you want to convert it into a file then that's the serialization so what's the need of customization customize serialization so basically customization is always required when uh, like uh, your data is is uh, not uh, not secure like uh, in serialization if you will uh, use transient keyword like transient keyword plays a very important role in serialization uh, in like when you are uh, using transient keyword and when you are doing serialization so when the object is gonna store in a serial uh, in a file that uh, that file won't won't uh, persist its uh, original value so uh, like suppose you are using int x and you are using the transient keyword so in the file it won't save uh, uh, its original value it will uh, store its default value so uh, when you will uh, you want that uh, the uh, value of that x so when you will like deserialization then uh, it won't uh, give you the or its original value it will always give the default value of that so customization is like to do extra uh, extra work mm, on the class so that we can get our uh, original value so suppose like uh, let me take an example like suppose we have a count suppose you have a account and the account consists of a username and the password and when you will serialize it is equal to uh, username will be suppose John. John is your username and uh, your password for it. Uh, suppose I'm using it for transient because we will save this value in the transient keyword we are using so its uh, original value won't, uh, won't be stored in the database so string password password will be 1234 and uh, like this and uh, when when we will serialize it custom suppose you have class custom serialize like you are doing serialization so we need a main method and uh, we also require the account object Account is equal to and uh, here we are printing its uh, the original value of, uh, of it like a dot name plus a dot password it's part so when you will print it its value will be john and one two three four and when you will uh, uh, deserialize it file output stream fos is equal to
new file output stream file will be abc suppose we are taking it and the object output stream And we are giving this value of file output stream. So when you will write its object OS dot um, write write object of A. So it's giving error because uh, we did, uh, we didn't provide. Uh, the implementation of serialization and we are using ser uh, serialization serializable and uh, here it will throw the error that throws the duration so um, here it, uh, we serialize it And uh, uh, we are deserializing from input stream. If I is equal to new file input stream, I will ABC. Object input stream. So when you will deserialize it, so you have a, when you will uh, deserialize it, then uh, it will appear uh, reading OIS to read object. So every time it uh, will receive a account object, a one is equal to, and uh, it will it will give it in the form of object. So type casting typecast it in the object every time you have to throw the declaration because this is sometimes if you generate a class not found there may be a chance of uh, that uh, there is uh, no class the, uh, there is no file in it so when you will print it even dot name even dot There is a problem in my console. Uh, you have to do something. Do one thing 
we start it here clips because sometimes there may be a chance of getting errors You can do uh, forward if you are in hurry. There's a, there's a problem in this. Uh, guys sorry for this uh, I will uh, finish it in the next part so this is part one so stay tuned sorry for inconvenience thank you